What is up guys, Rick Hackus here, and this is a scout rifle you need to know about. Now this is the High Road Soldier. Now this scout rifle is unbelievably good. And the reason being is its damage profile. This gun has a damage profile that is extremely uncommon in the game right now. Only about four legendary scout rifles I think in the entire game of all the DLCs have this damage profile. Now, what's special about it? Well, this gun actually has completely different rate of fire and impact as most scout rifles. If you look here, you can see the rate of fire is a little bit higher than on a lot of other scout rifles. And right here we have the Salvation State. Now, this is the most common scout rifle rate of fire and impact. Most scout rifles have this. Uh, the Vision of Confluence has this rate of fire. And you can see when I compare it here, very clearly, the High Road Soldier does have less impact, but it has more rate of fire. Now, why does this matter? And you're probably saying, well, it has lower impact, so doesn't that balance out? Well, here's the thing. The old scout rifles, like the Vision of Confluence, are capable of a four-shot headshot in PvP. The High Road Soldier is also capable of a four-shot headshot. The High Road Soldier in PvP does 55 damage to the head. So that means... That if you have ever done well with a scout rifle, if you've ever done well with the Vision of Confluence in PvP, the High Road Soldier kills in the exact same headshots, but shoots faster. Like, so yes, that is amazing. So you've definitely got to check this weapon out. Now, how much faster? Well, you can see here, I'm going to compare it to the Salvation State, one of the slower shooting uh, scout rifles. You can see right now, we've got the High Road Soldier shooting. We're going to switch to the Salvation State shooting, and then we're going to compare them shooting side by side. You can see that although the rate of fire difference is slight, it is there. And you know, kills in PvP are decided by the millisecond. So having a faster rate of fire gun that again kills in the same four headshots is an extreme advantage for PvP. Now you're probably thinking, okay, great, the High Road Soldier looks awesome, but they are so annoying to get. Getting stuff like the Hopscotch Pilgrim, like the High Road Soldier, grinding Vanguard Dragon, or the Prison of Elders constantly is not very fun. Well, you're in luck. There is a gun on sale by the Vanguard Quartermaster that has the exact same damage profile as the High Road Soldier. It's the 1-1 Synthesate, and this gun, again, it has the same rate of fire and impact as the High Road Soldier, so it's basically a discount High Road Soldier. In fact, it actually has more starting stability than the High Road Soldier. The downside is that the 1-1 Synthesate has a lot less rounds in a magazine, 14 instead of the High Road Soldier's 17. Now, mine is 13 right now because I had to use Brace Frame to uh, rein in the recoil because this gun does kind of recoil a lot, especially since you're going to want to have something like uh, Full Auto to make use of this insane rate of fire uh, bonus. So, both guns, both the 1-1 one -one and the High Road Soldier are going to need a stability increase. If you're using the 1-1 one -one Synthate, yes, it's a lot easier to get, but you basically cannot get Brace Frame because you can't lower the magazine anymore. Like, starting at 14 is already pretty low. Uh, going from 17 to 13 isn't great, but 13 is definitely not the end of the world for a scout rifle. And, um... The difference in stability for the 1-1 one -one Synthate, it is a difference, like the 1-1 one -one Synthate has better stability, but both of them, you will have to get a stability increase, so it doesn't really matter too much. But still, if you don't want to grind for days to get the High Road Soldier, and who does, you can just go and purchase a discount High Road Soldier, and you're still going to be able to do very well in the Crucible, especially if you can get uh, the bonus that lowers the range and increases the stability for the stability increase it's going to be great with that perk. Now this video was simply a showcase for the couple of scout rifles that do fit this awesome new damage profile that you definitely need to watch out for, but a full review on the High Road Soldier will be coming shortly. 
That's it for the video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, don't be afraid to slap that subscribe button. Doing so will let you see Destiny content similar to this. My Twitch channel and Twitter are both linked in the description of this video. So check out my Twitter if you want to get in touch with me, and check out my Twitch if you want to see my ramblings live. Again, I hope you enjoy, and as always, have a good day.